Well guys, uh, today we're over here at my friend Tom's house. Uh, we're going to be putting in the glow shift gauges today. Uh, we're going to get the boost, the transmission, and your EGTs put in today. So here we go with this today. Uh, we're going to start doing it right now. Get back to you in a minute. Alright guys, so when you uh, have one of these uh, Banks uh, Monster Rams, you can't put the bolt over here because the bolt fitting is too long. Uh, that bolt that's in there is way too long. The one that they give you from Glow Shift will not fit. So you can just tap it right here, right on the end of the, the where, where the MPT fitting is already at. It's easy, a lot easier. And we already got the wires run. My buddy Tom helped me run the wires. Uh, we're going to get this done pretty quick here. Alright guys, uh, we're going to use a uh, Dremel to cut this. Because the only thing that it's doing is one of those little pipe cutters uh, it's just pinching the tube so we're just going to use a Dremel and cut it straight off and then we'll uh, sand the edges down a little bit file them down a little bit smooth and then put that uh, T-fitting in for the transmission so we can get the temp sensor in for the trans alright guys my buddy Tom's here helped me we're going to cut this with a Dremel because it's too damn hard with a pipe cutter the pipe cutter is just bending it it's not doing a damn fucking thing so we're just gonna cut it with a dremel tool we'll get back to you in a couple seconds okay, we'll just keep on doing it he can cut it Okay guys, here we go. We got the wires hooked up to the trans sensor. I changed them because I didn't want to leave those uh, female and male plugs on them. So I did these ones with the heat shrink on them and shrunk them up. Make sure nothing gets in there. Zip tied them up. Ready to go. No leaks. Good to go. Over to the EGTs now. Alright guys. What's that? EG, EGTs in. Alright, so the... Oh shit, you're doing Yeah, no, no problem, man. EGTs are all in. Had to go to the bottom of the damn exhaust manifold. What a pain in the butt. Take the fender well out, take the wheel off, take the bottom air cleaner off. So, this is all in. We're gonna button this up, and then it's uh, finishing off the wiring. Guys, here we go. They're all hooked up, running, everything works. All works perfect. As soon as we uh, get moving here, they'll start working. I already tested them out in the garage. Everything's working good, hooked up good. Looks awesome. We will see in a couple days how they work.